You're still rocking with Bedouin the Moving IT, and this is our G segment of the show where we bring you everything entertainment, G's gossip, information, dissecting everything, information right here on the show. My friend, time now, Monil. Make you not play with your work with you, yeah? If you are a lover of high life music, then you should know the legendary Mike Okri, veteran Nigerian high life musician. Mike Okri has just signed a five year partnership deal with a digital music distribution company, which is coming after releasing his six track EP. We just released um, a, um, a six track EP, and uh, in a few months to come, we'll release the full album, which is basically. 15 to 16 songs and those ones will carry we're repeating some of my old works um, in collaboration with other young artists mainly female and um, we're going to be doing this as time goes on because the sense of collaboration is not just to make money it's to also be passionate about it so all the artists that we are going to be partnering with to do collaboration with my Kokri are those who can sing and are unique and good at what they do. Speaking to the gentlemen of the press at a press conference in Lagos, the face of this new development in the music industry, Mike Arkery is confident of a new era in the music industry. If we really want to make a great stride, or great strides as it were, in the music industry, we must also help others to grow. I could say, yes, the technology has advanced many to be able to create beats, even, even with their eyes closed. But that's just one aspect of the music industry. The business and so many others are still very relevant. So those are the areas where some of us with experience are still very relevant to make a bigger stride for growth. According to the founder of the digital distribution company, Olakule Oladeng, the development, amongst many other things, is to ensure the music is monetized and piracy eliminated. Music today should be seen as an estate. Estate meaning, you know, after us today, it can be easily transferred to the generation unborn, you know, who will continue to collect those royalties for us and be able to allocate appropriate rights uh, to not just the artists but also the composers and the songwriters. Okri dominated the music scene in the 80s and 90s with its like Time Na Money, Wisdom amongst many others. Time Na Money, oh, Time Na Money, Time Na Money, yeah, yeah, Time Na Money. Of course, this is Mike Okri and you're working with Bedou on the Move.